Hey y'all. We actually did a very similar dish to this a few weeks ago, but we used steak instead of cod. I wanted to show you how easy it is to swap out various aspects of these recipes so that hopefully you are encouraged to play around more in your own kitchen. Cooking really doesn't have to be complicated and more often than not, the biggest stumbling block to cooking is just not knowing what to do with the ingredients. Luckily, this issue is dealt with easily by practice and just getting more comfortable in the kitchen. And our goal at Paleo U is that the more you cook our recipes, the more you can see the patterns, the underlying principles, and eventually get to a point where you don't always need a recipe to cook. That's why I throw in dishes like this, where many elements are the same, but it's tweaked just a little bit to help y'all see how easy it is to use a recipe as an idea or a jumping off point, but then to start to play with your ingredients and make it your own. All right, enough of me talking, let's cook. Begin by heating the oven to 425 and lining a baking sheet in foil. Place the grapes in a bowl and drizzle with a little oil. Mix so the grapes are lightly coated in oil. Place the grapes on the foil lined baking sheet. Then you're gonna roast them in the oven for 20 minutes. When the grapes are about halfway done, heat a little oil or butter in a pan over a medium low heat. Once hot, add the cod and season with salt and pepper. Cook the cod for three to five minutes. Then turn over and cook for another three to five minutes. Then turn off the heat. Once the cod and grapes are done cooking, place a handful of arugula on a plate. Drizzle with a little oil and a pinch of salt and pepper. Top the arugula with one piece of cod. Then add half the grapes and a splash of white wine vinegar. Let's eat.